Hi Taze, I'm your host Zerbane, and today I'm doing another video log. You know how it is. Um, first of all, I want to say this. I do apologize for the video that I did post up yesterday because it really sucked. Um, see what happened was when I was editing and doing my video, it did not act up like that. It was running smoothly. It was perfect. It had no errors. They have any of the bullshit that's going on right now. It must have gotten laggy during the upload. For my probably, I would actually have to guess. So uh, I do apologize for the bad audio, the bad, um, yeah, everything. It just was, it looked so sloppy when I looked at it this afternoon. Uh, I woke up around like 3 o'clock, you know, because I was up all night trying to uh, fix everything and try to edit it and make it perfect because I wanted it to be on today. and Well, yesterday. And, um, so, anyways, I do apologize for that. Uh, the other thing, guys, I also want you guys to know that, um, you know, I'm going to be trying to put more quality games and videos up, you know, because I don't want to make any more sloppiness, so I do apologize. So, um, uh, the other thing is, um... I read a bunch of com you know, people commentaries and whatnot, and I probably would do it again, but from what you guys did not probably understand about the video of yesterday's, uh, what I want everybody to do is, if you guys want me to, like, talk, you know, say hey, or give you guys a shout out or whatnot, I'm not saying like, dude, give me a shout out, give me a shout out, I don't want you guys doing that, the way that it works is basically if I if I see your channel and you're doing good and I and I like it I'll give you a shout out no matter what but the thing is the way I want you to do it is by um, being supportive with the channel and watching the videos smashing the thumbs up you know doing your own thing you know hey you know, and the more people that are supportive that way, comment on my uh, channel and let me know what you guys think of the videos. Uh, the more you guys uh, um, show interest within the community of the channel, you know, I will give random sh uh, shout outs to those people. Just stay tuned to my uh, BL3 chat times videos and it will be given um like i said i'm going to try and give really good uh video quality but um i don't know what's going on man uh the other thing is um yeah my hair is kind of getting long and i don't know what the hell i have to do with it so i might get it cut i don't know like, I've been trying to save up money because of the fact that I've been trying to, uh, get my car fixed. You know, my baby is sick. And you know how we guys have to be, we have to attend to our beauties. You know, my Mustang's in the driver right now, just chilling. And, you know, and I gotta get some more antifreeze, man. I ran out of that shit. And you know, a car with no antifreeze, kinda bad. Uh, but, um, <clears throat> other things, I, um, I came across a few things, like, uh, people that are fans of, uh, The Elder Scrolls, uh, they are making a new DLC that will be coming out sometime this year, they haven't decided on the month, but... When it does, stay tuned for it because I will let you know when it will be coming out. Um, if you guys get game informants like this, you get a lot of the updates of what's coming out and when it's coming out. And 
if it's coming out. Uh, and for those that don't get Game Informants, well, I can't say anything. You can look it up online and check it out yourselves. Um, uh, let's see. Oh, and um, Diop, uh, not Diablo, uh, Black Ops 3. Uh, there's actually talks about the new uh, DLC. Uh, one of the map packs is going to be coming out for Xbox One, which I'm hyped. I can't wait. I never was one of those uh, YouTubers that went straight from Xbox to PlayStation so I can get my DLCs first. I stay with the Xbox because of the fact that you know I love the PlayStation. I am a PlayStation fan. Oh my god, is Sir Bane's a PlayStation fan? Yes, I am. I am the biggest PlayStation fan on YouTube. Because I started the first system that I actually ever got with the PlayStation. But the reason I'm sticking out with the Xbox is because it has better communication when it comes to um, BO3. You know, any type of Call of Duty games, it's greater in communication than the PS uh, communication systems. And I like that. And plus, I like to play Halo at times. And yes, guys, I'm a big fan of Halo. I played Halo from the beginning all the way up to now. You know, um, the reason I haven't done any recordings of Halo 5 is because I really don't, I don't know, like, I like Halo, but I didn't like uh, Halo 5. You know, it, it didn't come out good. Um, I don't know if it was the story or if it was, I've always, I've always been like a Master Chief kind of ordeal kind of guy. Master Chief was awesome and, you know, in this one, nah, mm, yeah, if I can't play as my favorite character, I don't want to play. <laughs> no. I said no. Learn that. <laughs> but anyways, uh, let's go to another topic. Um, I will be uh, doing a lot more um, Elder Scroll gameplays, of course, uh, than BO3. I don't know why, but and uh, yes, I'm still going to be playing BO3, guys. I'm just taking a little break off of it because I've been playing it ever since it came out, nonstop. And if I keep playing constantly then the game kind of gets old and when it gets old you know what happens it just goes out man it, you just burn out from it and you don't want to play again you know I bet you guys have actually played a game and got to the point where you played it so much that you don't want to play it again you know you, you know it gets like that it gets really annoying after a while uh, let's see, I will be getting a new, um, logo for the channel as well, guys, which is going to be freaking awesome. Uh, will I be making it? I'm not sure, like, I'm thinking about making it myself, but I was offered by somebody else that they would like to make a logo for me, you know, for the channel and everything, and, uh see how it goes from there um they want to sit down with me and tell me what uh how they want me to make it and we're going to discuss about different things um you know uh the uh, like the design the uh, the stat uh the the stature of the the wolf uh the way it will look, uh, the color base. If I want to keep red, still, you know, I don't like. I might, I might do a little different colors here and there, but stay tuned for that because it's gonna be freaking awesome. Um, and a lot of people have asked me what kind of beat do I use for my, uh, um, for the channel my intro beat that's that step those that don't know what that step is a, a it's basically under electro uh, electronics kind of beat it's like a techno kind of style and it's actually really cool I loved this beat 
ever since I was in uh, 10th, 11th grade when I heard it. And uh, I've been a big fan of it. And, you know, I wanted to put it for my video because of the fact that it actually is cool. But um, the way I'm going to do my intro and this, I won't probably have this beat going uh, for uh, my intro kind of style. You know, it might be like a little howling kind of thing. And, uh, or a growl following into a howl. And then the beat will come in and slap like the night into the wolf's head. And on the other side, haze on the other one, you would hear like a ding and then a howl. I don't know. I, I haven't decided on how I want to do it, but I was offered somebody, you know, somebody offered to do it for me because they like the channel and they enjoy it very much with the commentaries and everything. Um, just right now, I can't disclose their names or whatnot until we, uh, until, you know, I see how he or they. I should say they, because it's two people, and um, see how they're going to make it, and we're going to talk and see how we can do. Um, but it's not a high shore thing, because I know how I will, how I like to see my channel and how I would like to see my logo go on. But. Uh, once I get it done, if they do it really good and whatnot, I will definitely put their link on the channel below and tell you their channel's name and uh, etc. But for right now, as they told me and I accepted that I would not exclude them or anything within my channel other than this piece that I've just told you. Um, uh, let's see. Um, oh, I will be playing some more, uh, I might play some, uh, Black Ops 3 and posting it on, you know, on the channel, you know, not Black Ops 3, uh, Modern Warfare 3, wow, I said Black Ops 3, I might be playing some Modern Warfare 3, put it on the channel, see how I do, go back in the, in history and see my first Call of Duty game. Black, uh, Modern Warfare 3, Modern Warfare 2, and 1 were my favorite absolute COD games of the year for me. I love Modern War uh, the Modern Warfare franchise and everything that they had to do. Um, I love the story. I loved how they carried on the story back to back, back. You know, it, it, it was insane how they did it. You know, and I wish that they would uh, do that with every Call of Duty game, but it doesn't seem to do that. <laughs> like, uh, for good example, uh, Black Ops 1 and 2 had a good story together. Black Ops 3, I don't know what happened. Triarch, what happened? Black Ops 3, the storyline. Did not sync. Had nothing to do with um, anything with uh, Black Ops, and the story didn't make any sense. And for those that it did make sense, please write on the link below because I'm still trying to actually figure out what the hell happened in the storyline because it just went over my head, you know. And I'm not the only YouTuber, you know. Um, yeah, you know, I just seen a, uh, I just subscribed to a YouTuber not too long ago. Uh, his name is Elite Shot. You know, people always say that I commentate the same way that Elite Shot does. I'm like, I am sorry. I'm just talking to a camera. And which people end up watching me, which is you. And, um, yeah. I think that a lot of YouTubers do that. Oh, wait. Jet, 
Jacksepticeye does it, Markiplier does it, PewDiePie does it. Ah, we talk into a camera. And we do the same intros, right? Nope. We have our own ways and flaws and expertise, you know, but we're not quite the same. But a lot of people say that I do the same thing that uh, that Elite Shot does. Such as play Black Ops 3. Elite Shot plays that. Uh, so does half of the um, YouTube industry. Um, so, yeah, folks. Because I record on uh, because I record Black Ops 3 and show you my prestigious, it doesn't mean shoot. Red Mark of J plays freaking uh, Black Ops 3. Why don't you guys go comment on them? It's like, dude, you're doing the same thing that Night is doing. You know, <laughs> I don't see that, but I get commented on stuff like that, which it's fine. You know, it doesn't take me down. I, honestly, if I'm doing something that somebody that has really good, you know, that's that good, and Alicia is really good at commentary, I'm still getting used to it. I'm still nervous. And I like to tell you the truth, you know, so I'm going to do it. You know, I'm nervous as hell when I do my commentaries because half the time I don't even know. Like, I know what I want to say, but then when I get in front of the camera and I start recording, I get brain farts, man. Uh, by brain farts, I mean everything goes blank. A lot of people don't know those references, so those that do know, don't judge me because I'm explaining it. Uh, but, but it's a free world. You can do whatever you want. But, hey, I'm basically a little laid-back kind of guy, chill. And I like to do things of my own. Um, but the one thing I do like and enjoy is playing Black Ops 3 or any other Call of Duty game. I will be playing Ghost and I will be playing Advanced Warfare and recording those eventually. Uh, right now, I just want to take my time off the uh, FPS gamings and go for uh, Elder Scrolls. The reason I like to play Elder Scrolls right now is because of the fact that it's more relaxing and I enjoy the uh, the world itself. You know, it's basically you create a character the way that you want to build them. You can make a tank, you can make a DPS or a healer, pick a role that you want to be in the world and go on in the world and do whatever you can to be a veteran 16 that's the highest rank once you get to 50 see the way that it goes it goes like 1 through 50 once you hit 50 you become veteran 1 and then once you uh, go up again another 50 or is it I believe it's um, every 10 levels you get a uh, veteran level yeah it's every 10 levels uh, that you get to uh, veteran level, so every 10 levels you become veteran 2, veteran 3, veteran 4, all the way up until you reach the veteran 16, which is the highest rank in ESO, which is Elder Scrolls Online. Um, and once you get to 16, you basically build your armor sets. Um, by armor sets, I mean you got you go around Tamriel, that's the place that you're in, and you basically try to do everything possible to uh, find tomes or skill, you know, different things that you can make, like armor pieces, weapons, and whatnot, and you can actually farm for this stuff and run dungeons together and have fun you can run if you don't want to do pve which is uh player versus uh environment i believe it's called don't quote me i have to look it up but that's what i always thought it was pve players versus environment and um and anyways in this one you know with the pve you basically uh, are going out in the world and you run dungeons with your teammates, play quests and whatnot. 
Uh, of course, if you do not want to do PvE, you can go to PvP, which is player versus player. And uh, you go to uh, a section on the map where you can only play versus play. You know, you basically can see another player from a different uh, faction or alliance. And there's three alliances, which one is called the Dagger Falls. Then there's the Ebon Hard Pack and the Armory Dominion. And within this, if you see somebody from the Dagger Falls or the um, uh, uh, Ebon Hard Pack, if you're in the MR Dominion, you can attack them or vice versa. Uh, but the cool thing about it, they have objectives now within the within the PvP world, uh, side where you can actually do it with your teammates just go in and kill bosses so it's called a uh, PvP and PvE uh, environment and what you do is basically you're trying to do your missions or whatnot or if you're trying to do that mission you and the enemy teams are trying to get in there and trying to uh, destroy that uh, boss that you that you need to kill, you can rush in there with your friends or teammates and kill the enemy team, uh, the players, and kill the boss and basically swipe it out of their, you know, the boss kill from their hands, you know, which is kind of funny because I've seen it happen. Uh, I've seen other YouTubers record uh, ESO and they did it and it pissed off the players, but you know you can do it like that. Um, it's little objective games within it, and you want to watch out for other players that might end up intervening and killing you and taking your whatever goal you're trying to achieve. Um, and uh, the uh, PvP is, uh, you know, if you just want to do PvP, there's a section that's just PvP, no PvE required, you know, and even if you were into the other section where the PvP was required, uh, uh, like the PvE kind of deal, you don't need to do any of the objective games, and you can just go strictly killing people, or whatever you like to do. Um, uh, there's, uh, uh oh in um black in black ops 3 i am done with the shotguns almost yeah i'm technically done with the shotguns i'm gonna go do snipers and whatnot and all i will need is two snipers and then i will do the handguns and after that i will be doing the dagger which is the knife try and get that thing done uh but you know, I'm going to try my best to do everything possible, and uh, I hope everything that I do, you guys do enjoy, and if you, if you do, smash the thumbs up. It does help out the channel. Also, subscribe to Night Haze and become part of Night Haze family and organization. We're on YouTube today. You know how it is. You know, right now it's 2 or 5 in the morning, and I'm recording. Man, I've been up for a few hours you know I woke up at 3 so I might as well do a recording right <laughs> and I wanted to do a little vlog to explain about everything and uh, the and why my um, video of yesterday was kind of crappy and I do apologize you know I don't mean anything about it and you know I'm trying my best uh, and with other news you know I really hope that you guys enjoyed. We covered every topic that I had in mind. And um, if you guys have any suggestions or questions, write it on the link below. Because it does help out the channel. And I also will reply to you guys. I read those things on the daily. You can also go in my links below to search out um, my channels and my media. So with that said... I want to say thank you for joining Night Haze. I'm your host, Zerbe, and I'm signing out. Catch you guys later. Peace.